A hood river man is missing in southern Baja, Mexico, and tonight his family is trying to find this mystery couple that they think who were the last people to ever see him. 28-year-old Max Watson planned to go hiking in the mountains there for several days. Today, our Amy Frazier spoke with family members to try to learn more about all this. Amy? Jennifer, Max Watson has been missing in Baja for about a month as his family continues to search for answers. They hope someone knows this mystery couple, believed to be American, seen giving him a ride on December 18th. Twenty-eight-year-old Max Watson of Hood River is an accomplished downhill skateboarder, a master gardener, and an avid outdoorsman. And a free spirit, for sure. Definitely a free spirit. His sister-in-law and other family members are in Baja, Mexico right now, trying to find Max. Nearly three weeks without answers is taking a toll. We'll take anything at this point to um, see what we can come up with and see if there's something that gives us a new lead. Max and his family have been visiting Southern Baja since he was a child. And so this area is a place where he's extremely comfortable. Um, it's definitely a second home to him. In mid-December, he told his family he planned to go hiking for several days in the Sierra de la Laguna Mountains near Todos Santos. He planned to be back around December 21st. Dozens of volunteers have searched by air and foot, but they still can't find Max. We're still optimistic. If anybody can survive in the mountains this long, it's Max. They did find his white van parked at a ranch not far from the trailhead. On December 18th, a rancher there saw a mystery couple in a gray or silver car give Max a ride. If they can find the couple believed to be American, maybe they can help point searchers in the right direction. We assume that they just, the story hasn't reached them. And they don't know that this, you know, awesome kid that they met in the mountains is missing. And we just so desperately want to bring him home that we need their help. So if you know of anyone who was in that area on December 18th, you're asked to reach out to the family. We've posted their email address and more information at coin.com. Back to you.